So behind me is my cabin and last week I had built a solar ground mount and today I'm going to be taking these solar panels off my cabin roof and putting them on the ground mount. The two main reasons are my panels orientation is a little bit southwest so they're not getting sun early in the morning. Right now it's about 8 o'clock and also during the winter uh, it's tough to clean them, get the snow off. So there's a couple reasons and their tilt angle is not the best either. I put them up there initially because it was expedient. There's a lot of granite on the ground and I thought it would be a good spot to put them. And generally speaking, they do okay. I do fill my battery banks at the current location, but during the summer here, usually the mornings are sunny and then, you know, by the time lunchtime comes in early afternoon, you know, we're getting thunderstorms and it's getting cloudy. So when it's solar or noon, I'm not getting good production during the summer. So those are a couple reasons why, why I'm going to take these panels down off the roof. Uh, so let's get started. I'm going to turn off power. So it's a little bit of cat and mouse where the sun is. I've been using my security cameras um, basically to play back the day just to see where the sun hits early. Now my ground mount, yes, it's over here in the shade. Uh, it's just after 8 o'clock in the morning. This will start to open up soon. So I had considered, you know, putting it here. But the problem is then in the afternoon, as the sun gets higher, these trees start to shade. So I'm trying to find the most efficient spot. So this likely will not be the final resting spot. But that's where it is for now. I want to get started, get these panels on here. And I'm not going to permanently put my wires in until I find just the right spot for all the seasons. So especially in December, I'm going to be looking at my security cameras during the day just to highlight where the sun is on the ground as the seasons change. And having that ground mount not huge and unmanageable, I can move that myself as needed to a better spot until I find the most efficient location. And I'm going to be leaving the screws in here after I take them out just to prevent any leaks and then I'm going to come back and caulk all the screws. So the panels are down. These are Renogy 100 watt panels. And the other batch uh, is HQST or something like that. I don't know, I'm not brand loyal. I just get whatever's uh, the best price on Amazon at the time. But to have them all the same on my mount, because I measured for the Renogy ones, I have four Renogies up at my garage. I'm gonna swap them for these so that at least they're all the same on my ground mount. <music> So it's all hooked up. I still need conduit for my wire and I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it here, but I end up moving it like 15 or 20 feet over. But yeah, looking good and it's powered, energized. Everything's back hooked up. 